welcome to this channel on today's tutorial i'm going to show us on how we can make our app support android 12 so if our app is is targeting android 12 there are some changes we need to do we want for our app to be installed be able to be installed on android 12 devices number one and number two for play store to accept our app because currently if you don't have these changes play store won't accept the app so if for instance we create a test app we click on create app Then we click on this config we change our target sdk to 31 which means android 12. next we are going to do is click on this we click on show source code since then we select android.manifest select android.manifest then we we copy this we copy this we copy this now we go back to our activity on create our activity on create then we click on this we click on more block we click on command block our command should be find and replace xml name is android just like the android the manifest we selected exactly the same name android manifest dot xml then the reference should be what we copied reference should be what we copied so first thing we're going to do is we paste it again here yeah? then under it we write this android exported exported to so then we're going to check if it appears in our android or manifest file because naturally it's supposed to be a file we can edit with our string but sketchware is scripted so this is the only way we can only use it doing using manifest so using command block so you can see it has been added so now if we run our app on android 12 devices and above our app will install and play store will accept our app thanks for joining me on this tutorial the project link will be in the video description please note that command block works depending on the schedule pool version so if the the project doesn't work automatically for you you just need to do is copy the exact code and replace it with your own command block thanks for watching this tutorial please subscribe like comment and share in our next tutorial i'm working towards it to which i'll show us how we can use facebook login that is the same way we use Google login, we we'll use Facebook login to so login users' devices to our Firebase account or any or to the app as the case may be. Thanks for watching, please subscribe.